My journey into education wasn't, I suppose, a traditional one. Um, left school, as everybody does, with some qualifications. Um, had my family very young and um, always worked around those. Worked part time, worked as a cleaner, worked as a barmaid, I worked at the crisp factory. Um, so always worked, but never, never to my full potential. Always just to get by, always just to pay the bills. Had aspirations about what I would like to do, um, but didn't know how to do it. My journey into education started by coming down to the College of Further Education and it was those that kind of springboarded me on with the access course, um, minded access to health. Um, the tutors who were there were very supportive. You know, any questions you had, they would go and find answers for you. You know, they would turn up with phone numbers, we've heard about this, have a, give, have a call, give them a ring, see what's happening. You know, that push there, the sitting down and helping you to sit and write your UCAS statement because um, I've never done it before, so how do you start? They were there, that support they gave was fantastic. My inspiration in being a GP um, throughout the journey um, that I had and when I went up to medical school, um, we got lots of exposure to community medicine as well as hospital medicine and I felt that was the area that I wanted to go into. My biggest inspiration get me to come into education was my mum. Um, I had the impression that you had to be 18, perfect GCSE, perfect day level results to go to uni. Watching her do it as a mature student kind of gives me that push that actually you don't and you can do it if you set your mind to it and you're going to work hard. I think if I had to give anybody some advice about education it would be break the rules. Kind of not everything's going to fit everybody. Find somebody who can help you make them fit around you and your family. There is a way to do it. I started Hartlepool College doing an access to science course. I didn't fully know what I wanted to do. I had an idea that I wanted to work in nursing, midwifery, something along those lines. When I started the course, the tutors who were working with me were absolutely amazing and they went above and beyond and found all the courses that they knew I'd be interested in from the work I was handing in. So if it wasn't for them, I wouldn't have went on to the degree that I did. I think the highlight for me was my graduation day from uni, going with my small children, mum, dad, aunt's partner, um, and watching my dad almost crying when I went and got my certificate. I think that was, that was the definite highlight for me. Advice for people to go into higher education, I think, I think it would be have a go, have a look. There's always opportunities, there's always something. It's hard. Nobody says it's an easy journey, it is a hard journey and it takes a, a lot of commitment, you know, not only from yourself, but your family, everybody around you, but have a look, have a go.